My name is Angie, aka No Foreign, the baddest bitch that we ever meet out here. Yeah, I'm Tiffany Walker. You may also know me as Believable. It's Erica, also known as Envy Erica, and I may be little, but I'm feisty as hell. My name is Blair Hampton, aka Prissy Blair, and I'm about my back. I'm Egypt, and I'm here to bring a little Southern flair. It's your girl, Lissandra Marie, a.k.a. Rocky with the E, and I'm ready to shake this shit up. I'm Larissa. I'm really well known in my city, and I love living here. I'm Stephanie Paul Morris. I'm the barber you can't play with. And we are the real side chicks of Los Angeles. So today I'm having brunch with my girl, my best friend. Come in. Ooh, hey babe, look at you. We obviously need to talk about everything that went on yesterday. It was a lot going on. So we gonna recap, talk a little bit. Okay, so I got us some, well you some vegan food with your vegan ass. But you know, I got a little bit of food for us. And tequila and all No, it looks so good. Okay, man. Hey, thank you. Blair is my best friend. I've known her for about three years now. We are hella close. She knows all my business. I know all her business. You know, we don't, go, <laughs> we don't suck dick together. Okay, we're not gonna talk about it. But no, that's literally my best friend. So, I'm happy to be here. What's up? What you been doing? Girl, been remodeling, things like that. Are you gonna stop me's party tomorrow? Yeah. She, you know, I just talked to her. She said something about me decorating. I'm just trying to figure out, like, you know, what she talking about, like, money-wise, stuff like that. But, yeah, I'm going to be there. I'm going to look cute. I need something to wear, though. I might. I was going to ask about, you know, your little boutique. Yeah, I can get you something. Okay, cool. Definitely. Yay. Speaking of fucking parties, bitch. What's up? Oh, what? girl. <laughs> you talking about yesterday? Yes. Girl, that was corny as fuck. What the fuck? Yeah. You know people's feet got touched with glass. No. Yeah. Really? It was ghetto. I know... Erica got tossed in it because, you know, Angie is our friend. That's more her friend, too. So let's see how it goes, because I want to know. So let me tell you what happened after you left, because you seen all the shit prior to you leaving. Yeah. So pretty much they kept me in um, no foreign upstairs, and they tried to clear out the whole room. And that's why I was wondering, like, what the fuck happened to you? But um, they cleared out the whole room. They kept everybody, up, well, me, me and foreign upstairs. Mm -hmm. And then finally, we went downstairs. I guess the girls was outside, so they wouldn't let us leave the building. And, and foreign was like, Yo, like, I didn't even start the shit. Why are y'all holding me in this fucking building? You know what yeah, I mean? Girl. So I had to go get my car. We were trying to leave or whatever. Um, so they let us outside, but you know, everybody's security, everybody's still around, whatever. I went right next door to fucking get my car. Bitch, I drive back around, cause you know how downtown is, little one way streets and shit. I drive <laughs> back around by the time I pull back up, bitch, the two bitches, is her name Sandra or Sandra? I don't know. Uh -huh. Yeah. They was like surrounding her with four niggas, their boyfriends and two of the two other guys that was like randomly there or whatever. At this point, how I feel about Lysandra, I just feel like, you know, she is definitely, quote unquote, she's gonna have her back just like Erica has Angie's backs. They're gonna have each other's back then, you know, I feel like it's gonna be probably a conflict eventually because every time a conflict, there she goes, right there, Lysandra. And I'm like, hold on, hold on. Like, I just threw my car in park and I hopped up the car. I'm like, we're not doing this. We're not doing this. Like, what no, the fuck? Girl. You know what I mean? Like, they could fight. One on one. No yeah, niggas. it's no what, niggas, niggas. No, niggas no, there's, there was need, no need to be no extra people. What are you even mad at? Right. And she's like, um, she was talking shit when she first walked in about bitches wearing white dresses. And I was oh, I like, but too. yeah, girl, yeah, you know. I you know how it's for personality. Well, see, that's what I said. Like we laugh. Like y'all yeah, like, took it serious. Y'all really not. And I was that. like, you weren't even wearing a white dress. She was like, but I had white in my dress. Girl. I'm like, yo, I'm so it's not even that serious. I feel like she's a very and very animated person. Uh, she's a TV personality, and it's giving very much so for TV. Cause girl, you wasn't wearing white. You was not wearing white. You had little white stones in your dress. And she's like, oh, I'm mad about the white her coming in, talking about a white dress. You wasn't wearing a white dress, baby. What's the issue? But I get it, like. Well, we get Angie, because we know Angie. Yeah. They don't know Angie. So I feel like, you know, when she pop off or she being, you know, 
Like, she got a big personality. I'm the elephant in the room. They're gonna be like, well, what elephant in the room? Yeah. But it's still, girl, it's not that deep. But it they really made it so deep when the glass, girl, the glass got my feet. Yo, that's when I got high. They, someone said 5 I had to go, girl. I was like, what? No, like, that's when I got, the only reason I turned up was you could have hit me. No, I felt you that. You could have hit anybody in that room. And like, I said that too, because she did, she did do apologize downstairs. She did a little apology downstairs, but I felt like, I was like, well, girl, I still touch people, so. The thing is, I actually liked her, girl. We was wearing the we, same shoes. We took y'all pictures of y'all. Um, we was wearing the same shoes. I mean, not Louboutin. 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 Yeah. But that's you know what, what I'm mean? saying, girl. We can't be caught in the middle of shit. Girl, oh. I'm, I'm not trying to pick sides and things like that. I feel like, let's ask Angie, because maybe we can have them talk. Honestly, I think that's a bomb ass idea. Call First off, I gotta check on her. I haven't talked to her today. Let's make sure she's good. Yeah, call her, girl, because I don't want her thinking we're trying to be all, you know what I mean? I don't want to be and in the I middle of none of that to, shit. Yeah, Tell them I to did that, because that was corny. I want them to sit down and talk. Yeah, because... Angie needs to know, like, you know, how she comes. It's probably how she reflected, but I really don't think she meant nothing negative. Okay, I'm gonna call her. So we're eating good, we're drinking. <laughs> Barely eating, I'm not gonna hold you. We're drinking. And I get Angie on the phone. Hey, girl. Hey, bitch. Hey, boo. Hey. Oh, you, oh, you look good, girl. <laughs> no, yo, we're just, I'm at Blair's house having a little brunch breakfast. Bitch, drinking. <laughs> bitch, we're drinking. Uh, cheers. Cheers. Huh? It's the tequila. Where's my mimosa at? Bitch, we got one for you. How you feeling? I'm good. How are you? Good, girl. We trying to make sure how you feel, girl. Yeah, now we was talking about yesterday. Oh, yeah, girl, I feel so great. Yeah. I feel like that very much so. You said you feel like that bitch? Because you are that bitch, girl, period. And I'm sorry that happened to you, girl, because she didn't even know her. Yeah, nah. Definitely, we were just talking about all that. No, she said she's sorry that happened to you because you didn't even know her. Oh, girl, that, that's nothing new. You don't bitch nothing. <laughs> no, but I was saying, like, to know you is to love you. You got a big personality. You know, I walked in a room and shook the, shook the table a little bit. You, you no, always shaking shook the room. tables. She shook the room. He's no bitch. Blair said you shook the fucking room. Yeah, girl, you shook the room. I thought I shook the room. You was like, I don't even know her. I was like, damn, what's going on? I just don't feel like Angie and any part is wrong because you can't handle her personality. You can't handle it. Anyways. Yeah, what was I going to say? Um, the... I gave her some vegan food, like, you know, French toast and some potatoes. I got ate some burritos for Wait, myself. before we even switch this fucking subject, real quick, I had an idea. Okay. I want to run it by you. Um, so, you know, tomorrow's Stephanie's party. We're all going. I kind of want you guys to talk. I feel like... She don't know your personality, girl. No. Yo, that's what I'm saying. To know you is to love you. Yeah. Okay. She don't know your, her personality. Y'all, I know she would be down. And like you said, even the other girl, like you said, she was a fan of you. Like, I know she knows you. Like, it was like a bandwagon type of thing. I'm already knowing what time it was. Yes, exactly. Before the shit went left, like, me and her was having a good time. And that's something I feel like you guys would get along if you guys I knew each other. A, yeah, I, I like that you're saying that because, like, they know me. I'm down to have a conversation with a girl and be like, look, you heard, I don't know what you was feeling or thought I said. Like, I don't, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm old. Like, I'm nah. trying to be on that type of so hopefully I can set that up, and yeah. Yo, as long as you're willing, I'm gonna work it out. It's gonna be good vibes tomorrow. We turning up, we getting fucking drunk. And get sexy, bitch, because we taking pictures. <laughs> hello. <laughs> <laughs> she said hello. <laughs> All right, babe, I'm gonna call you later. Oh, I must have back mentioned. Okay, cool. Because they need to talk. I think she will love her. Nah, definitely, I think they will too. Um, get your drink, girl. You didn't even eat, so why did I do that? I came for the drinks. <laughs> so today I'm going to Jay Lorraine's boutique. She has the hottest dresses in LA and she's quick with getting something done last minute. And I had invited a little boo that we went on a couple dates before. Hey, friends. Hey, girl, that's Tom. <laughs> I ain't think you was late at Tom. I know, I'm sorry, I'm always late. I invited Prince to come help me out, be a stylist for my dress for my single release party. This is my babe bag. Hey, nice this is Prince. 
So a stylist can help me find my hot dress for the single release party. Okay, for sure. So Rax is an LA rapper. Um, I got connected with him just because I do music too and I rap. And you know, he's from New York. I lived in New York for a couple years. So give me that East Coast vibe, the booze I used to hang out with out there. I'm gonna let y'all do what y'all do. Just call when you're done, all right? Okay, cool. All right, all right, babe. So my man is supposed to be coming back um, to pay for the dress. I wanna use you so you can help me look the baddest I could tomorrow for my single release. We're thinking bossy, we're thinking loud. All right. We're thinking, you know, doesn't give a fuck. Show yes, a little bit extra key. skin. Yeah, Maybe. so I know that you can do that for okay. me. Yeah, so that's a vibe. It. So I've seen a few pieces. I was thinking about this, but this one is more dominatrix, but this is more mm -hmm. sexy and it gives a sex appeal and it will fit your body properly. So I would say something like this, you can, Open it on the side. Yeah, and it's I want the dress, the top. sexy, I want, like, all very. On me, yeah, so hell yeah. I want. So I would definitely here. say this for sure. I think you should try it on mm -hmm. to see if it fits you. Okay. And then we have this little top, but I don't think that's what we should go for. It's definitely mm -hmm. basic. Yeah, I might just look good in it though. And then we have pink if you want to go for Barbie since you are. Okay. Like, that's the vibe you get in. Very loud. Hell yeah. yeah. And then we have this as well. It will hug your body. It's a body suit. So, I like that. and it opens in the back. So, yeah, it's giving like all this life. Definitely. And then we have <laughs> this as well. But mm -hmm. I don't think you'll probably like that because it's basic. It's too fun. dark, yeah. Let's get something custom. Oh, okay, absolutely. Yeah, because it's big a bit and I want to look my best. Okay. So I don't want stuff actually on the rack. Yeah, I you want, want something that's custom, like no off the wrong way. Yeah. Okay, yeah, okay. let's do it. Prince helped me out find an awesome outfit. So I actually went to a party last night uh -huh. and I met like a lot of hot girls uh -huh. and you know, we mingled and they seem to like me. I'm fucking with their vibes. Uh -huh. And so I'm pull up, so we'll have some baddies. Uh -huh. I got my music producer, engineer there. I got the hottest photographer coming. Okay. So um, the, the girls that video. were in my video looking bad will be there as well. So it's a lot of important people. Yeah. It's definitely a vibe, you know, very like networking. You know, Ben, so it's to be lit, so it's very important that I look super hot. Today, Larissa invites me to Jane Lorene Boutique. That's a cute little boutique. I think I've seen it on Instagram before. We go because Stephanie needs a dress for her video release party tomorrow? I don't really know. I never heard this lady's music before, so I'm not really sure. And she has this dude she been seeing that like, I guess he want to take us shopping. I was down for it because I like Larissa. Like she's a she's a cute girl. She's brown skin. You know, I love team brown skin. So yeah, I was with it. I don't really know what happened, but so cute. Hi. Hi. Hi, how are you? Hey, you look so good. cute. Hey, hey this is What's Asia. This is Larissa. This is nice Chris. He's one of the yes. hottest stylists Ooh. in LA. Hi. Okay. And he's here to help me out yeah. so I could figure out a super hot outfit look for like the tomorrow. Look like the bad that you are. Yes. You know, try and be. It's you know, giving. You know, okay. start the show for tomorrow. And that's so. all. But yeah. What? Ooh, oh, yes. 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 yes, thank you. I was you. up for some wine. Yes. You know. So, yesterday. Yeah, what happened? I heard there was some drama, but I wasn't really around yeah. for it. it What's the tea? While we're at the boutique, I mean, they start asking me questions. And when I say they, I mean Stephanie and Larissa. I mean, you know, you got the mean girls, you got the bullies. Okay. And... So you felt like some girls were bullying other girls? I definitely felt like there were mean girls. That could never happen to me. Mm. For mm. <laughs> <laughs> It was definitely giving mean girls. As I'm picking out my outfit, I was discussing with Egypt and Larissa um, what happened the day before in the studio for our photo shoot. I think the girl's name like No Foreign. Okay. I don't, I'm not familiar with her. Okay. But you know, she came in kind of like spicy, like mm. giving energy. That's and very her. I've known her for years. Very oh, so dominant. this is her like. Yeah, I've known her for years. Very, okay, very so dominant. This is normal for her. So either you She she do what she do. Never like, had a bad time with her because like, she wouldn't try that with me. Oh, because so I heard the comment whoever about, she's trying that with, I don't know. But I heard the comment about the white. Y'all was the only two with the white on. No foreign came in talking about girls wearing white dresses when they were the two wearing white dresses. So if that's your friend, why she talking about y'all wearing white dresses? Right, we thought we were supposed to wear white. And I then feel like if she paid there, attention like... to the color scheme, mm -hmm. she would have seen there was white in there. It was, and sis definitely had on blush. 
Bless you wasn't in the like, color scheme. I was thinking it was white and nudes. Yeah. And then like maybe you could get away with like some gold maybe or something. Yeah, I was, but, I was giving that. So you're saying basically like she, Nora Foreign was like hating on one of the girls because she was wearing white? I mean, y'all was the only two in white. So that the, the comment was definitely towards y'all. Nobody else had white on. Hmm. So let's just clear that here. Like, y'all didn't hear her? Did y'all miss all that? Well, then how come there wasn't no animosity with us? Because we wasn't even know, there when none of that stuff I don't know. Yeah. But that was the we beginning. We were so shocked. We just was like, what, that what was happened the beginning. after we left? They obviously missed the fight. And they're like, oh, what happened yesterday? Like, you know, we left before everything popped off. The actual altercation, I really don't know how it started. I guess it was more like no forum was just making a little couple side comments. Because mm. when I met her, she seemed cool. She gave me a kiss on my hand. She told me I was pretty. So I'm like, oh, okay, she's cool. And then I leave and come back, and I hear her like talking about girls. And I'm like, oh, like you being catty. Mm. She didn't say nothing to me, but then she turned to Erica and was like, yeah, bitches saying my name like they know me. I'm like, girl, you were just kissing my hand. Oh, thank like, you. You were just kissing my hand, Come telling on. me how beautiful I was. So I'm just trying to figure out. So she's like, Say whatever she got to say. Okay. I didn't pay no attention because if it's not directed, then I'm not going to address it. Listen, if it don't apply, so that was it. let it fly. Yeah, but okay. my, Wait, my good know. Judy. OK, cheers. Cheers, cheers. guys, and helping me out. No problem. Look, my good Judy, Lysandra, though, she was like, did you hear what she said? I said, yeah, okay, I heard. Wait, wait. Who is Lysandra? She didn't she like a nude me. outfit. I don't know she did have a new is. dress on. I mean, I just met sleeve. her. I just met her too, but I was well, just like, more descriptive. Vibe. It was I don't, energy. I don't know. Which Dark one hair, that is. long sleeve. She's like she had like side part. She a little bit thicker. Part. I don't really know how to describe her. I mean, everybody likes you except me, you, Blair. So I don't know. But yeah, she heard the comment. I heard the comment too. She asked me that I hear it, and I said yeah, but she didn't say it directly to me, so I didn't give it no attention. Right. So what was the comment though? The comment about bitches and wearing the saying white her shit name or whatever. No, oh, that right. was a whole second situation. Bitch, it was like three situations with Damn. all no foreign. Yes. Okay. <laughs> this definitely came with the drama. Like, like girl, three totally different things popped off. No foreign had words for me because I thought she was being kind of catty. And originally when I met her, you know, she had good energy, but then I walk around the corner and I'm like, no foreign, girl, you being kind of catty. And she's like, oh, bitches saying my name like they know me, like, who is these bitches? I'm like, girl, I just met you 20 minutes ago. You was kissing my hand trying to eat my vagina. So what do you mean? The heat of it, what really started was that the white dress we were wearing white dresses. For sure. So, so she, basically, she wanted a white dress, too. That's what it sounds like. Doesn't that seem like a personal problem that it was sent out, what the color scheme I was mean, that? everybody got to tell you How you mad at yeah. everyone else that's wearing white? But sis was wearing blush, and it wasn't in the color scheme, but it's OK. So you know, she made that little comment. Lysandra, like, you heard it. Yeah, I heard it, but I didn't address it because she said it to somebody else. Then, before I know it, we like, you know, wrapping the shoot up, we going to the back. Sis took her dress off, she took her heels off, put the Crocs on. Crocs on? on? She put them bitches in sport <laughs> mode, okay? Crocs went on, and she ran out. Me and Lysandra was exchanging numbers, and I'm like, oh shit, I think she about to fight. As soon as we said that, she ran down the hallway, and next you know, she just charged at her, like. I picked up Lysandra's shoes because she threw them on the floor, put them in my bag, right? What happened to the shoe after that? I don't know. What? Okay. Cash was everywhere. Oh, I so ain't seen nothing else after that. The shoe, which we think allegedly, because I don't know, went through the window. Yeah, that's crazy over a like, color scheme and you feeling so some far. type of way, but. I mean, it was just like mad side comments and everybody was hearing it. So at the end, this okay. was like, who, what's up? And. She ain't so saying nobody in particular, but she didn't never funny. say nothing about no one person. She just was saying like little shit about general yeah, shit. It wasn't like so no basically, one bitches person. got irritated that she was being opinionated and like loud or whatever. Definitely, mm. she's yeah. opinionated and loud. And I mean that's cool, but there's a time and place for everything, and it's yeah, so bad, many different sure. energies in here. You don't know who on what. Yeah. And because you don't, bitch, read the room. Yeah. 
I'll never allow that. Like, you are supposed to read the room. Stay ready, so you don't gotta get ready. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Which I'm always gonna be ready. That's crazy. I wonder if she's like some type of feeling towards me because I was wearing white, but I didn't get no type of comment or no type of anything. You know, but I didn't, she didn't act like that with me, but maybe she knows better. Mm. I think she was intoxicated because by the end know. of the shoot, she was buddy But buddy again, with we know each other for years. She didn't know what's up with me. Like, I could also, look pretty, I, I could look all this, but I'm gonna fight real quick off a of comment. You don't even look like a fight. I know, but she knows me. I'm definitely with the shits. Like, okay. all the way. I'll never let no one talk to me crazy, badmouth me, like, try to punk me, bully me. It's Pick definitely on me. giving bully. None of shit. She like, one of the crew, and it's definitely giving bully. But again, you know, I guess when people sense who they can do it to, they, they will. Right. But right. when they know they can't, they're going to pick and choose. Because if it's that problem with right. wearing white, why is she getting bullied and I'm not getting told shit? Yeah. I just feel like, you know, I mean, but... Stuff's like, oh, well, no foreign couldn't have been talking to me because she already know how I get down. Maybe she was trying other girls that she don't know. I'm like, y'all were the only ones in white dresses. You and Larissa. So she had to be talking to y'all. She's like, no, she tries that with girls she don't know because she fucking know better. She would not try me like that. I'm like, OK, girl, that's your friend. Do y'all thing. We don't want that type of drama tomorrow for my party. That's like, not, we don't that's need not that. That's not even the vibe Hell no. it's I like, like bossiness. Sure I want us all to, like, you know, network. Definitely. There's going to be a lot of important people there in the for industry, sure. you know, and none of that. And if she tries some stuff, I'm definitely going to check her because I'm not going to allow that at my party. I mean, the bitches that's going to be at the party is the same bitches she was just beefing with. So it's very much a possibility. No, for sure, but... So just be prepared you know. for anything. Right, yeah. right. I mean, I fucked up to have to prepare, but let's face it. Yesterday, we didn't know that was going to go down, and it went down, and nobody Period. was so prepared. Something broke, it came out right? of nowhere. Yeah, the, like, the the window. Window. Broke. I was I glass break The window broke, but, but I don't I was know thinking, how. like, we only had plastic cups. Nah, she had a bottle. She mm -hmm. had Don Julio. Sis came to the, the spot with her. She set. brought her, her thing with her. her. Yeah. Mm. So I don't know, but I mean, the shoe was a clear chunky hill. So I don't know. That could have broke the window too. Yeah, there's not gonna be no shoes thrown at my party because yeah. I'm gonna come with the hands. No chunky yeah. hill. Because once I get mad, it's over with. It's all the friend, whole party that's done. That's your girl, right? So maybe you might need to have a pet talk with her. Yeah, I maybe probably definitely call her. have a pet talk with her, or we could call her. Yeah. But I feel like I'd rather do stuff in person, honestly. I'd rather be face to face. It's more mm. like yeah, you can't right. like I don't know what you're doing, what's on their yeah. line. You can take yeah. a second to pause, but when I'm in your face, you can't pause. Right. Yeah. Ain't no that's pause. True. It's A and B conversation, you know. So I mean, how I rather, do you think that's gonna go though. I don't think that I'm someone she wants to be enemies with. So that's what I feel. But sis was on the liquor, so I don't know. Yeah. She was definitely giving another personality on the liquor. And I feel like tomorrow we're going to be on the liquor. We're going to be turned up. We're going to be having a Back to the party. party. It's a party. <laughs> it's a party. The liquor's going to be there. You got to be lit, right. for sure. And I'm for sure going to be passing shots around and bring the bottle and, and you know, should, cause it's your all shit. that, because I want everyone to have fun. Well, we right. want to see, because I don't know. We it's giving know. part I two. I don't get out of hand. <laughs> what if it gets out of hand? We ready for whatever. What? Egypt was kind of making it seem like if no foreign was the one kind of starting the, the problems and she was the one kind of being the instigator. But then I saw a video after the fact. We ready for whatever tomorrow. That photo shoot was crazy. The photo shoot was but ghetto. Listen, we don't got time to keep on even worrying about that. Yeah, you know. Because it was sure. ghetto, it was real, it was out of place for what we got it going was. on. It was, it was. But let's get into these looks, because okay, that yeah, party... Probably. Yeah, what <laughs> is going up? It's going up. <laughs> yeah, what is sure. it giving? It's giving very much nothing. That's uh, this right not here. Too basic. Yeah, I basic. want to yes, uh, uh, I want to You know. Like That's OK. It's giving keys together. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, well, I am Mexican, so I feel it. Very okay. That's spice nice too. I like yeah. it. Let's, let's throw that in there. Okay, but let's get a couple different pieces. Is it a skirt? Is it? It's a two piece set. It's a. But is it a skirt? Is it a booty short? It's a skirt with a wraparound top. See through. Okay. I think it's gonna get okay. by. Yeah. I like that. Kind of get. I like that. Let's, let's throw it in there. Yeah. Let's grab a couple more pieces. I love that. Yeah, I love that. Get that in like two or three colors. Okay. Yeah, good idea. You know, it's a vibe. It's a vibe. She likes some stuff. Black dress too. 
You know, maybe Which one? What about this one? Dress How? Out. Like, I feel like your mannequin stuff is a little bit more like lit, like that. That white dress is giving. Like, let's just put there it. Yeah, let's bring it all up. Like, some options. Yeah, okay. like give glamour, give glitz, yeah. like yeah. diamonds or like. Or if not, I can custom her dress. We just need it by tomorrow. If you can tell, ask the designer. Oh, yeah. Cause we need it for her party tomorrow, so make sure she looks good. You gotta have yeah, it. Yeah, we gotta make it quick. You gotta uh, have it. We have okay, to. Okay, like do 24 it. hour turnaround. We got this. <laughs> I know you guys are gonna get it done. Yeah. Oh, Hell yeah. Yeah. Be well, let's go. Okay, cause... well, cheers to that, guys. We gotta cheers. Wait, oh, yeah. We lost it all in. Yeah, they're making sure? custom. Yep. I'm gonna take those just in case. I might change a few times tomorrow. So true. No, As you should. Why not? As you, know? As you should. Yeah. I think it's a good look. Hell yeah. Two ain't enough, but yeah. we'll see. You know, Steph, you know, she got like big boobs, big butt. She has to get everything custom made. So Rax was supposed to come back in and pay for my dress. Um, He ended up kind of flaking on it. So basically he didn't take us shopping. He was like, whatever, anyways. Nobody worried about him. But he definitely skipped out on the bill. So forget it, I'll boss up and buy my own dress. We gotta come back and pick up whatever, but she had to pay for it herself after Rax was popping all of that stuff. I don't know, LA's a really funny place and people waste their last dollars on cars and clothes and jewelry they can't really afford. So that way they don't really have to cash out on girls. I'm not that girl, you need to cash out on me. The more you got, the more I need. Ain't nobody worried about Rex. He just ended up being a clown. And you know, Patrice, he got something, but not really cash out on me. So I can't be with those type of busters. getting outfits for Steph's party tomorrow because you're going to the party, right? Okay. All right, so clearly they weren't there when all the drama went down. So I kind of gave them a little brief story, but I didn't even know that the glass didn't break from the shoe. Okay. The glass broke because no foreign intentionally like elbowed the window, bitch. Like an idiot. Like trying to be like a big bad wolf. Like, girl, what? What's he? But this is my problem. You're not big bad wolf, bitch. Because when we was right there, you didn't want this talk. You was real quiet. You was like a little chihuahua with your like tail tucked. You feel me? So, look, tomorrow, what is it giving? Because Steph was basically like, you know, we just trying to have a good time. Like, I don't want no drama at the event. Like, you know, I'm just trying to like turn up. And I'm like, well, sis was given when she got drunk, when the liquor activated, she turned into a super gremlin. So. No, guys. But see, my issue is that I already know she's going to, and I fuck with Steph. But my thing is, I already know she's going to go left. And let me tell you why. Because every time that bitch get a little bit of liquor in her, she gets extra bold. And everybody around her always wants to see her and enable this grown ass bitch talking about, oh, if that's how she is. Okay, well, get that shit together and quick, bitch, because I don't play that, period. So you think it's gonna get spicy tomorrow? Like, I'm trying to be cute, bitch. I ain't trying to, like, I got tape ins. I don't want my tape ins flying. Like, that's no, not. No, I feel you, I feel you. I'm not gonna go with that intention, bitch, but you already know. So can we keep it cute in the beginning and whatever happens, happens? Absolutely, absolutely. We can do that, but, you know, can't make promises, baby. All right, well, I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want it to seem like, you know, it's three against one, but y'all my bitches and I'm a ride. I mean, I ain't know. No, I'm already, already done, but you know what? You ain't got to worry about that, because at the end of the day, we not bullies. You feel me? We're not bullies. Right. We don't, we don't need to do all that. At the end of the day, it was... We had our own individual issues. Right, and that's what I kept there. telling them. I'm like, they had issues. Like, that's the thing. Y'all didn't know they had issues already. Mm -hmm. so exactly. 
So I don't want it to be no weird shit. We just gonna go in there, good vibes, cute girls. Like, for real, we don't even gotta pay that bitch no attention. Like, we not yeah. there for her, we there for stuff. It's support for her and what she got going on. So we just gonna go with that. Absolutely, and you know what, you're real right. So I'm gonna make sure to try to keep them cute, but you already know, shit. We all need to be on the same accord because yeah, because I already told you, bitch. You already know the deal. I'm going to keep it a buck with you. Let me tell you why I had to run up after her. Because in all reality, I had a, a conversation with Erica. And Erica had already let me know about how uh, she's cool with Angie or Horn. Horn yeah. Whatever the fuck you want to call her. Wait, you just call this bitch Horn? Horn. Bitch. <laughs> bitch. She was telling me how she's cool with her. Uh -huh. And that basically, if she, you know, is about to squabble, that basically Eric's gonna, Erica's gonna ride for her. And uh that's what you should do, because that's your homegirl. So that's Period. why I had to feel like I had to be there. Because if any bitch decides to hop in on some funny shit, yep. then you already know how that's gonna go. Yep, yep. Well, bitch, I didn't even know she was giving it up like that. Erica don't even seem like she got that type of energy. But, I mean, if they bringing it, then it's just whatever. But, yeah, all right. Yeah, exactly why I had to run after my bitch like that. Because I'm like, nah, y'all not finna do her, period. Because she can hold her own, as you can, as y'all know. Yeah. But at the end of the day, ain't there gonna be no funny shit. I'm on motherfucking go. And that's what I said. You already know. It's giving 3 lw okay? <laughs> <laughs> anybody can run up and get done up. Hello. Well, at the end of the day, you know, I know that we're going to have our little alliances. Everybody has their own personalities. So with that being said, everybody's not going to click. We just happen to right. click instantly. And right. I fuck with y'all. Like, I'm a ride or die, but it's not going to be a situation where it's like, oh, they always need backup. Like, nah, because bitches is grown. Like, bitches could really handle their own in real life. So don't ever get it fucked up. Like, we don't need no squad. Right. So, right. well, all you right. Already, I'm already there, sis. We, we already know that. Then what they perceive and what they get out of whatever they get, it's whatever the fuck they get. But at the end of the day, fuck that. We know what it is already. I just, I just feel like tomorrow is going to be crazy. Like, that's just it. I don't even know what else to say. I just think it's going to be crazy. So, well, bitch, just be prepared for whatever. Just be prepared. No, yeah, facts. Because, bitch, I can get my runners popping or I can get some cute sedan heels popping. Oh, bitch, the flip flops is going to be in the bag. Okay, so. Oh, yeah, all right, well, I'm about to meet you so we can go grab some food and then, yeah, let's get into something. Okay, boo, I'll see you in a little. All right, later. Okay, bye. All right, bye. Wow, bitches is crazy. So Blair had invited me to the house that she decorated for my single release party. For it to be such short notice, I would hope she was appreciative. It looked very nice. Cheers. Mm. Ooh, where's Steph? I think she should be here. So my girl Blair has been hired by Stephanie to put her party together. So she's coming in to look at it right now. Yeah, well hopefully she likes it. I mean, I know the budget was small, but at least my dude found something for her last yeah. minute, girl, cause I had to work what I came with, you know? So when we get to the house, we're like, okay, this is a cute neighborhood, but at the same time, there's no parking. She didn't say anything about hiring like a ballet or nothing. So we didn't know like if it would really work out. Um, when I came in, the house was cute. As far as decoration wise, it just seemed halfway done. Who's <laughs> Hey, babe. Oh, hey. Hi. 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 Hey. This property's pretty nice. Thank you. I yeah, so it. my dude found this real last minute. Sorry, since it was really short term. I found some so, sponsors for you. Okay. Yeah. Hey, sponsors. Yeah, I got you some sponsors, Liquor babe. Liquor sponsors? Liquors. We have to toys, you know. Okay. Toys and stuff. I got you a 360 camera. Okay. So if you guys okay, want your guests you. to take some pictures. You know, pool table, I don't know if anyone's gonna be on that vibe, you know, everyone's gonna be more so, yeah, for your music. 
stuff like that. It was um, set up very nicely. She got vendors. Um, the house was beautiful. We had a little camera thing. It was giving very much a vibe. So I'm gonna show you the pool area. I know you kind of wanted a big pool, but this is the pool. It's heated with jacuzzi. I'm sorry it was kind of small since the budget was a little cute, you know? When we get in the house, we thought it was cute. We liked it. So what do you feel about the budget? I just feel like it was small. It was very small, you know? Oh I heard already complaints. I did get you some sponsors, stuff like that. I know you was gonna have a big crowd, but this is all I could come up with. Okay. It's definitely cute for the budget. Yeah, that's what I said. And we got the hookah sponsors. You know, I just don't know if you, I know you mentioned like a bigger pool. They were staying in the, you know, so. I mean, it's not an infinity pool or nothing, but we can make this work. She has a little, you know, attitude because the pool's, you know, not what she expected, but it was last minute and the budget wasn't what it was supposed to be. It's definitely not bad. It's cute. Yeah. It's cute. Like, even the budget I give you is mm -hmm. not what the house is worth or the scenery that you did. I feel like. But it was last minute. It was I a day bad, notice. But that's what you do, though. Yeah, but it was a day notice, sweetie, so this is what it was. Stephanie did want a big pool. The pool wasn't big. I think that was the most major issue. And Stephanie did get a little offended when Blair told her that the budget was cute, but I mean, she was honest. It was a cute budget. I feel like if she needed some extra funds or if she just needed some extra connects, or maybe you know how that is, like someone wants to like take, you know, pride into doing something themselves and they don't want help, but then sometimes when that happens, things don't come out as the best results. We could take this out, and you don't have to have it, you know what I mean? Okay. Even the sponsors, people were like, well, I can try to get the equip. Even my man was kind of, I had to beg him just to do the budget. Beg? Yeah, girl, I had to beg. Just don't do that, hours. don't do that. I did. Then she kind of said something about like, she had to pull a million favors. I mean, uh, I did. If you want to talk to him, you can. Hold on, if you had to pull a million favors, like, Maybe we'll just like call one of our friends and pull one favor, you know? I feel it. That's Maybe we should do that. At first, I think she was trying to say she didn't like it, but then I had to tell her, like, well, girl, like, it was such short notice, and I hope you know with the budget that you gave me, it was kind of like, girl, this is the only thing that my dude can even come up with. I like it. I feel what you're doing. I'm just very, like, opinionated. I'm going to say what I feel. Yeah, I tell me. I, I, I like know, you. and that's why I was so and trying I to find something. I love the video. You're done. I get okay. it. I just, I am who I am. I know. And I'm going to do that with everyone, A, B, C, or D. Whoever yeah. the fuck is in my life, I'm gonna say the same shit. And, and I, I fuck felt with that. it and I love it. I just feel like, you know, tonight the vibe will be cool. Mm -hmm. You do what you did for the last minute. I fuck with it. Yeah. Like, you know. I feel like it, you know what I mean? I feel like it could have been bigger if it was more no, not last minute. And if we had a bigger budget girl, I would have had it balled out, I promise you. I feel it's but, last minute. You, you know, we could do what we can do, you know what I mean? Everyone's you still gonna enjoy themselves. Once it gets You're dark, gonna get your credit on a everything. Whole different thing. Yeah. And your credit too. Your yeah, name baby. Being blown up and girl, that two you cars, that okay. Yeah, this is like, gonna be that lit. You, that bitch to <laughs> call for anything. Let's anything. just enjoy it. Let's make sure the girls enjoy themselves, you, you know. Breathe. You're getting paid. It's yeah. the point of yeah. like, exactly. at least you made it happen. Right. You know what I'm yeah. saying? So we just gonna make it work. I squashed it that I feel like, you know, let's just enjoy it. I found our sponsors immediately like, girl, come on. This is a, a single release party and it was quick. You're gonna like it, trust me. Look, it looks good. You, then, did, you okay. did very well. Obviously, I have my girl Blair's back. She always did what she's supposed to do. And she did what she could with what we had. Okay. I, like it. It but I want you to have fun. I want you to turn up, girl. Like this it. is your day, so make sure you enjoy it, okay? I like it. Okay, baby. We put our differences to the side and decided to go with Blair because we do know that she knows what she's doing when it comes to this event stuff and, like, decorating and everything. So we're trying to trust her that she's going to help this event be the best it's going to be. Cheers, Cheers baby. Oh, we got to get them. Oh, we got to get them. them. Right. Yeah, yeah. Get Can you grab me a drink? When I... Come on, let's go. Can grab we all go in the kitchen? Like, yeah. Stop. I do give her A for effort. She did go out of her way to try to get it together for me while I'm being busy being an artist and doing stuff for that. And I do appreciate it. It just, it was cute. Dive in head first. From there, we just start fighting. Oh, 